Hey guys, what's going on? Uh, today, uh, we're gonna start the vlog inside the car here, because uh, we are going to take care of some of the comments you guys have been leaving about me not having window tint. We are gonna get that taken care of today. So, I'm not 100% sure how dark we're gonna go yet, or what exactly we're gonna do, but we are gonna get this done today. I just want to take a minute to uh, thank all the recent subscribers, man. I, it, it has been amazing lately. I've, uh, the channel has been growing like crazy. Ton of views, ton of new subscribers. Uh, I want to thank each and every one of you for uh, supporting the channel. Hopefully it continues to grow and uh, we can keep doing mods and doing uh, bigger and uh, better things. Like I said, eventually uh, the dream is to own a Lamborghini and I've been saving, do what I can do, but if I could get a little uh, little help from you guys, that would be great. Uh, so, once again, I just want to thank you guys. Uh, if you haven't subscribed yet, please do hit that like button. Leave, leave a comment below uh, what you think of the uh, the tent when it's uh, complete. Uh, let me know if you would have went as dark as I did, or if you would have went lighter, if you would or wouldn't have done your windshield. So leave a comment down so below. Like I said, we are on the way uh, to get the windows done in the car. I am tired of living in a fishbowl. Everybody can see you. Everybody's judging you. And you know, we just don't need anybody knowing what we're doing. So we're gonna get this done. Like I said, I'm not sure how dark I'm gonna go in the front. Uh, I mean, I wanna do it legal so I don't have any issues, but I don't think legal is gonna be any fun, so. Uh, we're gonna get here. We're gonna talk to these guys. Uh, we're going to uh, Tent Right is the name of the place. Uh, I've heard a lot of good reviews about them. They were uh, pretty good on price and everything. So we're gonna check them out, uh, see what they have to say, uh, what they suggest, and uh, yeah. So like I said I kind of want to do the windshield because with the uh, interior of the car being red, I'm afraid over time. If I don't get the windshield done, that it's gonna fade and it's gonna look like crap. So uh, that is obviously one of the reasons why you want to get your windows done. Obviously, to help protect your interior. Uh, other reasons why you want to get it done is when your car is sitting out in the sun while you're at work or doing whatever you're doing. Uh, the window tint helps deflect a lot of that heat, so the interior of your car will not get as hot. So. I definitely want to get that done because uh, it's hot and humid in St. Louis. You, you've been at work all day, you get in your car, and it's you know, 120, 130, 140 degrees inside your car. It, it's just freaking miserable. So, like I said, we're going to get this done. We're going to check it out. Uh, I uh, definitely think the white car with the dark, uh, dark tent is going to look uh, amazing. So... I think I'm pretty much just going to leave it up to the guys at the shop and see what they say and probably take their recommendation. The only thing that I am worried about doing the uh, windshield is I do drive a lot at night and I'm kind of concerned about that. Also I know in Missouri it, 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 it is illegal to, uh, to do your windshield. So that is yet another problem and you know with everything going on you don't want to draw any more attention to yourself than you have to. Uh, like I said, I drive this car quite a bit, so it is what it is. I uh, definitely want to have a car that I like and I'm going to drive, but at the same time, I don't want to be uh, having to deal with uh, police officers on a regular regular basis, because uh, let's face it, that's going to get expensive if they want. I think that's a couple hundred dollar uh, ticket here in St. Louis. So, uh, yeah, so I want to go ahead and end this here until we get there and then uh, we'll uh, pick back up as soon as we can. So we'll give you a little uh, before and after. Sorry if you hear, uh, got, got the kiddos with me here. Uh, so yeah, give you a little before and after just how light 
It really is. Like I said, you can see all the way through. It's, uh, yeah, it, it, it needs to be dark. I'm tired of the fishbowl. So we're going to get it done. Uh, as soon as they open up, we got the first appointment of the day. So should be done pretty soon. And then I'll give you, of course, an after of what it looks like when it's done. So uh, I will get back to you guys as soon as this, uh, as soon as they get it done. All right, guys, we got the car back. Uh, we got it all done. Uh, we did go, uh, I guess you would say, on the illegal side for it being Missouri. Uh, anything on the windshield of Missouri is illegal. Uh, it does vary from state to state what you can do and what you cannot do. But Missouri is an absolutely nothing on the windshield. So we went 50% uh, tent on the windshield. And we did 5% on the sides. Here, we go to the other side. So it definitely changes the look of the car dramatically for uh, for the money it costs to change the tint on your car. It is definitely drastic. It definitely makes the car look uh, more sinister, I guess you'd say the word. Definitely, uh, definitely makes it look meaner. Uh, gonna have to uh, do some more stuff to it make it look a little better but uh, for everybody who wants to know what it looks like on the inside we'll uh, jump in so here we are on the inside windshield at 50% tent and the sides are at five percent so when you're inside i mean it definitely makes the car a lot darker for sure uh definitely gives you privacy you're uh not gonna see anything from the outside looking in uh when the car was in full sun you could kind of make out an outline but you could not tell anything about who or what was in the car which is what i was after you know until uh so I have a meeting with the uh, police and then I have to explain why and I have to pay the fine for having this. But this is what it is. This is what it looks like. Uh, obviously the sun's still up at this point. So I don't really know how it is to drive at night yet. But I can only imagine if it's this dark during the day how it's going to be at night it is definitely going to be hard to see but it is what it is i like it it looks great um i would definitely recommend doing it especially if you're worried about the uh, interior of your car because <sighs> uh doing the tent it does block like 99 percent of the uv UV rays and that is what you are after trying to block so your interior doesn't fade it'll also help it from uh, cracking drying out uh, less maintenance on it so that is definitely well worth the money uh, the place I went to uh, everything cost uh, $350 all said and done so all in all it's not that bad uh, I did not go with the uh, ceramic tent. Ceramic tent, although it does block a lot more of the heat, it was also $200 more than going with, I believe they called it the Black Series. So, yeah, that's uh, what it looks like. Uh, so, Zim. Leave a comment down below on how long you think it's going to take for me to get uh, pulled over by the police because I, I give it a week tops. So hopefully it lasts a little longer than that because uh, I believe when you get the ticket, not only do you pay the fine, but I believe they make you prove that you fixed the problem. If that's the case, that is definitely going to suck because, I don't know, I guess it was like $100 to do the windshield. And then the side windows. I don't. I don't even know. But yeah, it's gonna suck. But until then, it's worth it. 
All right, guys, I think that's going to wrap it up for uh, this uh, video on the window tent. Uh, leave a comment down uh, below if you would do uh, the window tent on your windshield uh, or what you would have done uh, differently than I did. Would you have done the windows uh, at 50%, not at all, uh, 40%, or do you think I should have done uh, the side windows lighter? So like I said, leave a comment down uh, below. If you haven't yet, smash that subscribe button. And until next time, you guys have a good day.